Hello, beautiful family. How are you all doing? Thank you so importantly for always supporting this platform. I really do appreciate. If today is the first time you are coming across us or you are hearing our voice for the first time, you've already know who we are already. So my wonderful family, <laughs> without not wasting much of your time, let me just go into the news in details. See, eh? <laughs> When I say it is shocking, I mean every word I am saying it is shocking. Kinapa just released distributing videos of adopted former Nigerian president Jonathan's cousin, Mike, crying for help inside a shallow grave. In fact, is a video that I cannot place or someone cannot watch it twice because it is so horror. Of a truth, YT will not allow it here. So the video is so disturbing. How can people be this wicked? They've been announcing it all this while about what they are doing to other people. But some persons still believe that it's a joke. So just listen to the audio, the message that he sent. He is crying for his dear life. Life is the money that is there more important than my life. You are seeing me in the grave. Please do everything possible. So come and, and lose me. Any money that is available, any money that you can make, do everything possible. So come and release me. Is the money more important than my life? Is the money more important than my life? Is the money that is there more important than my life? You are seeing me in the grave. Please do everything possible. So come and, and lose me. Any money that is available, any money that you can make, do everything possible to come and release me. Is the money more important than my life? Is the money more important than my life? It is so sad. I know that for a very long time, people have been receiving this type of... Uh, uh treatment from these people but at times what is condemnable should be condemned things are getting out of hand in this country i don't really know if some persons are not seeing it a lot of people have turned arrow ip a lot of people have passed through different means or the other for them to be free for them to live a good life but still nothing seems to happen this is a country where Muhammad Buhari has changed everything. This is a country where the APC government know, was, know exactly what they are doing. And today, a lot of people are still clamoring for PVC, clamoring for election without not, first of all, tackle what is on ground. The country is seeking each day. Who can rescue us from this, from the hands of these people? That is why at times you should not blame people that are saying that they don't have time to vote anymore because they have passed through a lot. They have seen a lot. Just imagine someone that is a family turn arrow IP in the hands of those people and they were unable to rescue him. And tomorrow you are telling the person to come and cast a vote. It will be so difficult. If not that the country has failed, do you really think that with the voice sound, with the voice video that he has dropped, if it's really a developed country, they can trace these people with the sound. They can trace these people with this video. But believe me, <laughs> not a country like Nigeria. They don't have what it takes. They are not even ready to risk their life on it. Do you know that the, the Boku Boku that escaped from Kuje prison, it is not obvious that is a signed deal. Do you know that as at 9th of uh, July 2022, Boku just released some Kaduna adoptees, okay? Like the ones that they released, they are high-profile people, they are about seven in, seven in number. This is a bargain, okay? This is what they are doing. They use you to trade. And a lot of people lost their life as a result of that uh, trade incident. So now tell me, who is fooling who? When you know that this is the situation or the hope of these people towards the country, what will you do? Will you sit down and wash your hand and watch these people taking advantage of all that you have labored for? in life just for you not to eat the fruit of your labor because there are some persons that believe that they are more nigerians than others 
Come on. You don't need to blame people that say they need division because they have seen a lot. There is no way that you are going to convince a lot of people because the country is not working and the foundation is so corrupt. And when the foundation is corrupt, it is so difficult for you to start from the top. Rather, you must start from the foundation. The country has dirtied a lot of people's image. As a country, Nigeria is a complete failed state. The attack on the presidential convoy, that is Muhammad Buhari on that very day, the breaking of the Kujé prison, I see that these are all set up because they are people that they knew very well. After the incident, these same people came out and tell you that they are going to do more if you do not release their people. And what is going on right now? They do it for you and they show it to you. They speak their language and they tell you that we are the people that do it. But up to this very moment, they have not been fresh at they have not be caught. They are committing it and going away so freely. But when you talk the other way around, now I just believe that the people from Southeast or the other part of the country will realize that you don't belong here. These people, they don't really want you and they don't even care. They show it to you that they are the ones that are ruling you because they are, the, they are in charge. And they give you the warning that as far as the country is concerned, there is nothing you can do to them. And believe me for as long as we all know for a very long time nobody see anything that is wrong with the uh, funani government or with what they are doing okay remember one of them came out the other day and said that an attack on boku boku is an attack on every funani is an attack on every northerners tell me can somebody from southeast part of nigeria say that even you talking about mazinam the canoe is a problem what did he do he is a freedom fighter just telling the people that the treatment is wrong just telling the people that the one nigeria is not working just telling the people that the maltreatment is too much and what happened they gang up and they said no we are going to shut his mouth so that he cannot talk but people are committing worst crime People are showing it up to this very moment. They have not been tagged. They are going away so freely. They are going to their everyday business. They walk around without nobody monitoring them. Even amongst us, there are people that knows where this Boku Boku lives, going to give them money. The video is everywhere. And we all just pretend as if nothing is going on. See, it is time that you know what you want. You don't expect somebody to come and meet you and tell you that that, oh wake up before you know that you need to wake up from your slumber you have to wake up from your sleep and stop dreaming so my wonderful family i just want to drop the the the, the updates here and relax myself because it is getting out of hand indeed so please do well to share this video like and subscribe we still remain progress news giving you all the update back to back Thank you once again for always supporting this platform for years. From here, I said bye and remain blessed.